Fort Wentworth, Georgia. When police try to pull over a motorcyclist for speeding, the man takes off. He's southbound. Southbound 95. The cyclist doesn't have a record, but he's risking everything to get away. When he veers suddenly into this narrow construction zone, Sergeant Matt Libby follows. He's whipping in and out. But when the officer behind Sergeant Libby tries the same thing, he loses control. Sergeant Libby can only watch in his rear view mirror as his fellow officer spins out. He didn't wreck his car, but he was out of commission for a minute, and then he got back into the pursuit. But now the cyclist is catapulted ahead. The officers have no idea where he is. Trucker, give me a hand. Where'd he go? When they catch up to him, they see the driver taking more and more chances. Sergeant Libby gets on the PA. Give it up, driver. He's on a wrap. Give it up. Give it up. He barely avoids a catastrophic collision, squeezing by the semi. He can't really go any faster. But the man continues to push his bike harder, reaching speeds of over 120. Then he does something completely unexpected. He pulls over. He wisely realizes that anything is better than losing his life. Give it up. When I asked him, I said, why did you give up? Why did you stop? And he said, man, I was afraid I was going to die. But it's not over yet. The officers still have to be ready for anything. They pounce on the suspect. They're not about to give him another chance to escape. You're under arrest. Welcome to the state of Georgia, buddy. As it turns out, this guy fled from the police because he didn't have insurance. He didn't know that as an out-of-state visitor to Georgia, he didn't have to have insurance. His daredevil moves needlessly turned an ordinary ticket into a triple count of speeding, reckless driving, and fleeing a police officer. And though he got taken down hard, considering how hard he ran, he's lucky to be alive. You're under arrest. Welcome to the state of Georgia, buddy.